So guys, I am here trying to record and lesson kids having praise and worship just around my house. This is the package I received from them. In this box here, it contains 16 shades. I do not have the exact 16 shades here. So I'm missing the shade number 6. I arranged my calculation off because I don't want to waste you guys' time. So you guys would have seen my pistol on Instagram. But if you haven't, I'm just going to link the post description box. You'll be able to like check out where I wrote about the brand. I also give hands watches there. This is what the foundation bottle looks like. And it is plastic. This is what the sample bottle looks like and it's not for sale. So the foundation comes in three categories. You have the L, you have the W and you have the D. I believe the L stands for light, the W stands for warm and D stands for deep or dark. So now I want to show you guys the lightest and the darkest in the range. So this is the lighter shade in the foundation range and this is the darkest shade in the foundation range. I already picked my shade. I could mark up between shade um, 15, 13 and 11. I could wear either of them but I'm gonna wear 13 today. The foundation claims to be weightless. It claims to give you perfect skin. I don't know how that worked. It claims to be lustrous and it also claims to last all day. So what if my skin is not perfect with the beauty? That place has a bit of hiccups. What if I don't have a perfect skin? So this just doesn't make me make my skin perfect. I'm not gonna be wearing this foundation for 10 hours like I normally do. Probably would do a full face using the beauty and then I would do a wear test. There's no other beauty blender I'm gonna use for this foundation review, if not the In My Skin Beauty Blender. So right now I'm gonna blend my face and see how this goes. From my end, the foundation looks good, but it also does look orange on my skin. It is medium coverage, but it's almost like a skin finish foundation, okay? So I'm going to highlight with the shade 11. I feel like shade 11 is more of my skin tone because it's neutral. So that is 11. Highlight under my eyes because I don't want to go too bright. I would also have used a concealer, but no. I just want to do the whole thing as a foundation. I think I do have like a good look right now. I have like a good, you know, amount of coverage and like it does look very good on me right now. I like it. I like it. I don't know. Now, um, 13 and 11 is a good combination for my skin too. So now it's time for me to use setting powders. November Beauty Currency does not have setting powders, but I believe they are working on it. Let me just go in and learn me see. Oh God, it looks good without powder already like I can basically go out like this I'm just gonna push my brow because my brow is kind of oily I'm a bomb beauty what's your secrets can I come for your secrets can I come for your secrets this is good like I look so good. For lashes, I want to go in with Lost Lashes. This is what Fiji looks like. For brows, I'm going in with the Angad Beauties. Brow Lucia.
So for lips right now, I'm going to go in with the Beauty Line by Didi Lip Liner. I'm going to use the Novum Beauty Concealer in 50. Okay. So now I'm going to go in with that shade. It's a pretty shade in it. And now, I know Beauty Line by Didi has a brush, but I don't like to use brush. I have to use my hand. Then, make matting. Pencil. And, uh, correct it. For highlighter, I'm just going to go into the normal highlighter brand I normally use, which is Blush Crush. For bottom mascara, I'm going to go in with the Primark 3D Lash Effect Mascara. Okay. The Revolution Caffeine Essence. I'm not going to close my eyes because I just applied the mascara, so I'm just going to look down. This is my finished look, guys, and I do I recommend this foundation? I definitely do recommend the foundation, but please make sure you check the ingredients in case you react to it before purchasing. Because I remember a friend of mine mentioned that she reacts to some ingredients in this foundation, so look out for that, okay? Retails for $6,500, that's about $18. I believe if you deliver worldwide, I'm just gonna put the brand in my or just the link to the website for you guys to be able to shop. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next one.